The Minot Commission on Aging was up in Adam early this morning preparing food around 6. That's an early wake-up call. KX News' Corbin Warnock hopped along for the ride with some of those volunteers as they were making the rounds. Members from City Council, Ward County, and local nonprofits were all busy volunteering their time with the Minot Commission on Aging. I got to see firsthand how this program works by going on a ride-along. Today is March for meals, and it's a good opportunity for our community to come in and visit and see and ride with some of the volunteers so that way they can see what our program entails. You know, it's, it's a bright program with the food and the services that we provide. Volunteers delivered ribs, broccoli, baby potatoes, along with a fruit cup and bread and butter Wednesday morning. However, serving these seniors meals isn't all they do. Well, our seniors are, some of them are homebound, so this is an opportunity for them to get a well-balanced meal, and it's also really good because they have a personal contact with our volunteers every single day of the week, you know, so check on them and make sure that everything is going okay for them. Meals on Wheels provides these meals to seniors every day of the week. And March for Wheels is extra special because it brings awareness in the community to all of the seniors who are dealing with hunger and isolation. But you don't have to take my word for it. They're nutritious, they're delicious, uh, convenient for me because I don't I'm not able to do a lot of cooking. It's a life saving. Summerfield is one of the volunteers with Meals on Wheels and says on her route she serves 25 people. But she's also a senior herself. For myself as a senior, it's nice that I know that that opportunity is for myself and my husband to have this in our city. Almost 400 meals were served, including those who came in to the Commission on Aging Building. Food that does not get delivered gets sealed and frozen and delivered and delivered on the weekends to seniors. Reporting for KX News, I am Corbin Warnock. They also deliver to people who live outside of town when they're able to. That's good to hear.